try to understand the next option which is weighted by category so now here what we have to do is first we need to create some categories some grade categories and then we will assign weights to those categories so i'm going to select weighted by category option now and let's first of all add some grade categories so for that we click on add grade category now here what you just have to specify is name of the grade category and the corresponding percentage so i'm going to create two uh, grade categories the first is assignment and let's say i would like to give 70 percent weightage to the assignment remaining is 30 percent i add another grade category and i would like to give it as test and let's say 30 percent is for test so these are my two grade categories after this i'm going to click on save now as of now you'll be able to see that nothing no grades have shown up and that is because we did not actually assign any grade categories anywhere for that what we need to do is we need to modify these individual assignments and tests and assign them to a particular grade category so let's see how this works first let's go to test one and we have the option right here to edit it so i click on edit now here you will observe that grade category has been added so let's add it to the test category so this is test click on save so now this belongs to the test category you'll see that the overall grade has begun to change as soon as we start adding this again i go to assignment 2 click on edit and now i'm going to change its category to assignment click on save again i go to assignment 1 and here i change the grade category to assignment and i click on save so now you can see that the final weighted uh, the grade that you get is 79.25 percent how this has been calculated is by a simple formula what has been done is it first of all calculates the sum of the uh, all those assignments which belong to the assignment category so that will be 90 plus 15 after that uh, you get the sum and you multiply it with 70 that was the weight that was assigned so this is like 70 percent and finally to take the average you need to divide by 120 this is then added to 3 multiplied by 30 divided by 5 so after this mathematics that you do you get 79.25 percent so this is the final grade of the student using the weighted criteria grading so for that if there is some assignment or test which you would not like to use for grading you can just leave it as it is and it will not be used for calculating the final grade so this is how weighted category works one final thing that i would like to share with you is about how can you actually selectively give assignments to students so for example you have a project and you would like to create groups and let's go to classwork and let's try to create one simple assignment now what i would like to do is i would like to assign separate assignments to separate students so this is let's say project for group one now what you just have to do is here instead of selecting all students let's say i club these two into one uh, group i'm going to just uh, write the instructions and add the assignment here and click on assign with this what happens is that this particular assignment will only go to this particular group